What are the three reasons you should invest in an Airbnb in Arizona? Number one, strong demand for short-term rentals. Now, in any market, it's all about supply and demand. The demand is strong. The supply has actually increased because this concept is not new to Phoenix. What makes it so strong? The demand is that we have amazing cultural events. We have a monster golf tournament. We just came out of the Super Bowl. We have spring training. We have companies that come here on golf outings and all kinds of corporate retreats. We have folks that live in Phoenix and like to do staycations. Well, vacations within the city where they'll go outside of their homes and they'll rent an Airbnb, et cetera, et cetera. There's a strong demand in the Phoenix metro area, specifically Scottsdale for Airbnbs. Number two, favorable short-term rental regulations. Now, this is ever-changing and this seems to be in the news almost weekly. However, we're still in a favorable environment. If you play by the rules, you understand the rules, this could be an optimal investment. Number three, real estate appreciation. Now, we're still talking about the simple ownership. You're investing in a property, most likely a single family home, could be a condo or a townhome if the regulations don't prevent that, the CCNRs don't prevent that. So typically in Phoenix, we've, we've had steady appreciation year over year, decade over decade. So short-term rentals offer an investor the potential for increased uh, return on their investment compared to long-term. Long-term rental would be like a 12-month or longer unfurnished. So that being said, uh, the short-term rental market is strong. A lot of investors are curious or interested because they want to uh, put their money into residential real estate. I'm Scott Graff with Team Graff at Real Broker. Phoenix, Arizona, hyper-local expert. If you have any questions with any of the content in this video or anything real estate related, call me at 602-989-7900.